yeah okay um so uh discrete port was not good you you are saying I, uh means um, what, how was the results basically the result uh for what we simulated yesterday yesterday okay. night um this is the far field cut I think the result looks looks good. This is fine. Why is cut like this? Do you see the screen right? Yeah. Uh, this is uh the validation result what we did yesterday. Um actually uh i was uh this one i did not simulate it because uh my computer memory is not supporting and uh, i've actually uh sent it to the school server okay so i'm uh i'm waiting because uh, someone is also doing some work so i'm waiting to simulate okay. today uh, no no actually in order to validate this process so i think uh horn antenna uh alone simulation is fine uh, the results are yes, okay all, on antenna alone simulation this is the result is fine fine so it's yes. for uh, for both uh, uh webgate port you are getting the same that's what we want to confirm no i didn't try to webgate port no no, no, I, no. Just... I think you know it's better to verify verify so you can save us this okay okay we need to verify this okay otherwise you know so can you go to uh uh s11 please s parameters please okay okay how much it's coming see it's not matching so i think we have to boils it boils down to wavegate port only okay so it may be issue with the horn itself Uh, that's why you know we want to confirm by you know assigning the uh because you know i we, the, the moment i saw the addition pattern i identified okay. can you go to an addition pattern uh, to... can you save us this can you save yes. us this okay okay i'm going to save I, i want to show you this is what i designed it again yesterday use okay okay use the spot uh it actually give very good um output you know uh, i just deleted the result right now but uh, okay. i imported the far field yes this. exactly this is what i was telling you yes so i imported the far field uh, yes you can move it. anywhere you want that's it actually this is the far field correct correct Supporting. correct yeah you can export right when you click on the far field report and then right export then you yes. will be able to. yes correct so i export the far field to 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 the array uh like this but uh, i'm having problem like uh, it's telling me i don't have extension port so i don't know where okay. where to assign the port which port can we need we need to extension because when i run it it's give like you see no extension source have been defined okay okay thing uh far field port is there can you click on that what is the what it showing um it's saying that no extension source have been defined so far please define at least one port field source okay, or plan okay. wave before starting okay 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 click okay click okay i think uh, we have to run this in uh, schematic i believe so okay so can you go to the far field on the left No, no, that far field FFS. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Click. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Click on the far field. Yeah, click on the far field. Double click on the far field. Double click. I'm not getting anything. No, it's not getting anything. Just this. Can you accept my okay. request? 
Okay. Okay. So then I think we have to run it in this way. Uh, here I have to see. Uh, <sighs> this is array tasks. No, it's for the. This one task. But uh, hey, somewhere we are missing. Okay. Yeah. Mm. So this is the power wheel source, but yes. uh, you know, uh, but it will be another source basically. Uh, this is it will come here creating now maybe maybe it's miss which will be one i think uh No, 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 not this way. This one, no. Here, any template is coming? Uh, sign with user define. Yeah, oh, not this, not this. Any import option is coming? Uh, no, no. Yeah, there is a there is import 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 ASCII table. ASCII table. That's different actually. If you want to import this extension source. Yeah, can you do you have that? Where is that one for fill source? Okay, it's from. You see, I don't think. Let me show you. Is here? Um, but you are storing this in desktop. Yeah. No, no, no it's no, not no. in desktop. Okay. This is the file filter. So this one. You can click on that. No, I don't think it will select. I can click on that. OK, open, open. No, it's selecting. Click OK. Yeah, I'm, it's selected. Click OK. I can click OK. Yeah, yeah. No. Ah, that's what, you know, it won't. It's not, a, you know, ASCII format, right? So I yes. think uh, we have to play with this one. 
a long, very long back, I did once actually, but uh... maybe if you assign the port, is that going yeah, yeah. to work? That's what uh, I'm going to try this one. Let's see. Here actually somewhere any import option is available. No. No. Actually this one. Let's see. OK. This is far field. Okay. Let's see, see. What is this one? This is okay, but what is that one? The other one? This one? Okay. Is it's the same? No, no, the uh, It's a same far field. Okay. No extension port. Okay, I don't think it will work there. Basically, yeah. I think here actually one option is there. Mm. Uh, I was thinking if we assign, we put the fan field on top and we assign the plane wave on the ground. Is it going to work? No, 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 it will want to work actually. Basically, you know, um, somewhere actually uh, try to find out uh, one actually option is the field sources um, let me try to find out that uh, file
Because I'm thinking like uh, importing file feed will reduce the simulation time, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It will definitely reduce with the simulation time. So, but you know, one option is there. Let me. Okay, reflector. Elevation. Using schematic. PST. Okay, meanwhile, you can, uh, you know, uh, uh, save this file on and run, okay? And then we validate that result uh, first because, you know, if it is working fine, I, meanwhile, I will try to find out actually. Okay. Yeah, yeah, we'll, try, you know, today we'll try to sort out this issue. No problem. <laughs> Cancel this. Uh, we'll copy this file into. Uh, it's okay Uh, you can try something, okay? This one you Going to try. Let meanwhile, I try to find out that. Okay, just a moment. Okay. Okay. I will, you know, stop stop controlling this. You can so that you can control. Okay. Okay.
Yeah, I got it. Okay. I will share you that file. Okay. Hello? Hello? Hello, Fabrics? Hello, Fabrics? Hello, sir. Yeah, yeah. Hello? I am sent. I am sending you that file. Okay. So okay. LinkedIn. LinkedIn. Oh. Okay. I found that file. No problem. Okay. So we will okay. sort it out. No problem. We can, you know, even feed that uh, false field source everything. So it is very simple. Actually, basically, you know, uh, we need to 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 to. We don't have to, you know, uh, simulate much. So it is very less memory is required for that. For five feet, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, basically, we have to go to modeling the reflector. The distance, OK, then approaches proposed or flow. Can you so control fine. it, please? Yeah, no, no, you can. I know I, I have sent you that. Uh, can you download that? Okay. Or that? I can tell you where I have where you have to do. Accurate and systems this design studio project. Okay, circuit and systems. Okay, then uh, studio so block. Yeah, this one. So okay. uh, can you go to you no know, more pages? Uh, can you come back to this CST? I can tell you that. Okay. Um, okay, here actually, can you go to this? This one, right? So here yes. actually you delete the source. Okay. Yes. Delete the source. Uh, where is that one? This one. Delete the source. Okay, now let it be reflector alone. Okay, so okay. we have to come over. Oh, why it's coming? Yeah, you have to save this file. Can you save this file? This one? Yeah, yeah, you save this file. And it. It's saved. Yeah, saved, right? Yeah. Yes. Oh, OK, now. We have to drag and drop that uh, source file here. Or we can import as well. OK. Just can you drag and drop here that uh, far field source file? OK.
It's okay, Mr. If it not, if you're not, oh, one minute, one more thing, you know, we can do here also. One minute, one minute. Yeah. Yeah, right. So I can, you know, I can import the blog as well. For example, here. There's no right click is working. Right click. Yeah. There is no. There is no way. Just rename. No. I can drag it and drop it here. Yeah. Yeah. Is adding the block, right? Yes. Okay, so now it has come. So, okay. So it's a kind of a source file, right? Now, yes. what we need to do is see. Um, okay, let it be coming. Where is it? Okay, it's a source file, right? Yes. So now, So now layout assembly. Here layout is there. OK. Can you go to that uh, uh, page? Insert the file. Uh, the file field? Yeah, no, no, no. Uh, yeah, yeah, whatever I have shared with you. That uh, PDF file. Can you uh, open okay. that file? I will tell you where you have to go. You go to page number 50. 15 or 50. 15. Um, you can go to. Five zero, five zero. Five zero. Yeah. Hold on. Yes, yes. Next. This we have done already, right? Drag and drop. Right? Yes. Correct. Okay, next. Yes, correct. Go to next. Next. Next page. Here you can see layout. But in, yes. now they change the name as assembly, right? Yeah. Yes. You have to do this job now. Okay. Okay. Uh, layout. Can you click on the layout? It will, you know, um, yeah, assembly. Click on the assembly. You build the model like this. Correct. Can you see yes. here? Yes, yes, you can Correct. see. Correct. Yes. Okay, now you have to align this source first. You align this force by you know using transform function. In that, as mentioned in that uh, one, okay. Yes. Like um, you can move to wherever you want, right? Uh, yes. Can you go to uh, in that? You know they mentioned right translate and other other options, right? Can, uh, yes, see but, uh, but here I cannot. Here I cannot uh, translate it. I don't know. Okay, one minute. Can you go to navigation tree? Oh, no, no. Uh, yeah, uh, navigation oh, no, tree here. Yeah, yeah, but no, not here. Maybe. Uh, no, 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 no. Before building this, see, before building this, you have to transform basically. Okay. Where is that one? Uh, I think it's gone. Oh my God. So, <laughs> it's okay. Yeah, can um, you please open again? Yeah, I think we have to go to that uh, schematic and then, you know. Oh, sorry. No, it's OK. Uh... Is Gary asking you?
We let it open. Let us check uh, that the waveform. Oh my God, nothing is there. Yeah, I think. I think because. Uh, oh, it is showing, right? It's supposed to show. Oh my God, sorry. It's okay. So let us check this one on monitor. Okay. Actually, let us complete this task. See, the matching is perfect, right? Yes. Correct. And far field pattern also, it is perfect. You can see here. I think, you know, discrete code doesn't work for this. Very good, basically. Because, you know, it is only helpful in a SMA connector like that, but not yes. in this one. Yeah, because you know it is very difficult actually. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. You won't get that in uh, the other one. Okay. So can you do it this again? Okay. Yeah. Can you do it can again? We, can we use this one? Can we use this yeah, one? Yeah. We this can one, this one also. Yeah. Yeah. Fine. Fine. Fine, yeah. we can delete this one. Yes. Uh, I feel you can delete it. Hey, still, it's not working, right? This one is not working. Yeah, right? still not working. Still not working. Oh, okay, you can delete that one. No problem. We can delete, we can delete the feed. And we keep the ray. Okay, now. Schematic. And then you can imp import the block. Okay. Uh, what do I need? Uh, okay, okay. But that block, that block was uh, for uh, for for this code port, not wave guide. That far field. Is it still okay, or do we one need second, to save far field one? One second, one second. No, no, that's okay. Any far field. See, far for us, we have to find out whether it is working or not. That's it, right? Okay. Oh, it's not updating this. Now it's updating, right? Okay, now we have to drag and drop. Where is that? Uh, yeah, is there. Okay, now okay. what we have to do is this one you have to transform. You need to transform it first. Okay. Translate. Docs on antenna. I think translate is maybe translate can come out after okay. assembly. Any transform option is coming. Uh, we have rotate, rotate left, rotate right, flip. Where is that PDF file? Yes, it's the last one. Yes. Can you see here? Oh, hold on. Okay. Can you see here? Translate. Yes. Transform. We have to do that. Otherwise, you know, it won't work. So. 
Okay, let us proceed. Let's see. Yes, it's out already. Yeah, okay. Now, navigation tree, where is that navigation tree? This is the one, right? Yes. Okay. Now, transform is working. Ah, yes, it's yeah, working. It works now. Okay, okay. Fine. Now, okay. So, now we have to move, for example, Z axis. For example, where exactly this is located? Oh, it's already there. Only I have to do the rotation, right? Correct. Yes. Okay, so along which axis I have to rotate? X axis I have to rotate 180 degree. Okay, then I have to use shape center. Correct. It is coming yes. right. Yeah. Okay. Now the maybe settings is changed. That's right. Okay. Now. Yes. Okay. Now can you see here? Yeah. Perfect. Can see. Okay. Now uh, we can simulate. That's it. Okay. Here you have to go and update. That's it. Here you have to add uh, uh, what and all you have to do. For example, uh, post processing we have to do means. Okay. What you have to observe. For example, gain gain plot, right? Usually that, gain plot. Yeah. That gain. Okay, yeah. Gain for field uh, result is that. Oh, gen 3D or uh, for field and antenna properties. Okay. Then uh, this one is for field result. Yes. It's up. It's up. It's here. Let me let me bring it out. Okay. All settings. Is here. Let me bring it out. Okay, one minute. One minute. One minute. Yeah. Uh, browse monitor. I'm bringing it out. Sorry. <laughs> I'm <laughs> sure. Okay. I'm sharing the screen that way. Let me bring it out, please. Yeah, yeah, please. Is out. Yes. Okay. So we have to select basically far field, okay? A broadband, yes. broadband basically, okay? Then it will come automatically, okay? Uh, 3D. Then here results now. Optimization parameters, anything you want, you can do. Okay. Okay. So now you give update. It's not working. Uh, I mean that the template template based processing result direct relativity 3D. I think we have some problem. We can make it big. Or large. Just a moment. Yeah. Feel simulation project. Okay, okay, okay. We have to do some other thing also. Okay, okay. A transform done, right? Now we have to go to simulation project. Actually, actually, sorry, sorry. I forgot to do that. Simulation project. Field source coupling is that. Yes, finite source um, coupling. Where is it? That's one. Yes, that's one. No field source. 
Filzus, there is no Filzus. Just a moment, actually, maybe settings got changed. I think oh. this is maybe that was the old version. Maybe new version things has changed. So uh, from this one, how can we calculate the distance between the the source and the uh, and the field? No, you are only giving right translate. Okay. I think I think uh, the the error is from the post processing. No, no, that's okay. But uh, we have to do this one; otherwise, it will not work actually. Okay. Basically, any anywhere you are finding the layout. Yes. Where is that? Uh, the layout. Maybe that I mean, is what one? they change it as. I think that is what they change it as assembly, right? Yes, this is assembly. Okay. Yeah. okay, some name might be changed. Is not this one? Yes, definite electromagnetic coupling. No. No, 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 not that one. So let's see. Oh, 3D model is this one. OK, now we are assigning it as 3D model. Okay. Then. Entire equation or any solver you can select. Yes. Then the yeah, reflector. This is what the reflector. Okay. Next, yes. we have to do the same thing for source.
I saw uh, that all block has 3D model. Maybe we supposed to do all all of them sometime. The second one. All blocks has three years. Yes, that's one. No. Maybe it's only consider the array, not the source. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. For the source, we can define the you know um, uh, frequency. For example, zero to uh, 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 what is the frequency range? Uh, from this one, I think uh, twenty three to thirty. Yes. In steps of five, right? Yes. Let's say one. Click OK. OK. At least one frequency. Oh. This is the far field source. Oh my God. Mm. I think one by one we have to do. OK. Yes. Ah, yes. So we have to follow that. Uh, thing. Can you try this one and then you know, let tomorrow morning we'll let you know. Like tomorrow OK, morning, you know, can you see here this one? Yes. Okay. This okay. one you can see here. They are modeling each and everything. And then you know, here you can see. Yes. Here you see here. Far field source. Everything we are selecting here. Yes. And then you know. Here is here. Here it will be reflector and feed antenna like that. Okay. Then you have to select this far field source. Can you see here? Select it. Yes, you can see. Yeah, sure. then this one no you can you know rotate anywhere you want that way you know you can do this offset pad basically all right so all right will, whenever whenever you do this variation in the um this one no, it will automatically get updated here that's how it works okay. basically okay this okay. one you know um if you go further down you can see here 
can see here. Yeah, this is the far field results. So this is the far field result. You can try this one. OK, you can try this okay. one and then let me know. OK, you can see here. OK, so everything is we can possible. It's possible. Yeah. OK, all right. So Thanks and so uh, one more thing, you know, uh, it is very much pretty much clear that, you know, we cannot use um, uh, which port discrete port discrete. for this uh, horn simulation. Only okay. option is left out is, you know, we tried with the WaveGate port, but uh, it's not, you know, working for offset pad, right? The only option yes. is this one, this one only, okay? Just, you okay. know, placing the far field source, that's all. That is the, this is the only option available, but that also we cannot simulate with the normal uh, 3D format. We can only simulate through schematic, right? So this, okay. way, this way we have to do. And uh, maybe, you know, Maybe we may have some solution, but I don't know. But now we are not getting that uh, solution, right? So yes. just offset better, right? All right. Yeah. I'm going to yeah. try this. Uh, yeah, yeah, please. Maybe, maybe tomorrow morning when you walk, when you walk up, maybe I'll, yeah, yeah. I'll let you know what I've done so far. Sure, sure. And one more thing you were uh, showing that, uh, you know, C CST simulation, right? Sorry, MATLAB simulation. You want to do so in the morning oh, you okay. were showing something. But I know, but, but I was, yeah, yeah, you were showing something, but you know, I was uh, rushing through. That's why now I could not able to. Okay. Um, okay. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that was, uh, um, uh, let me sh do you see do you see the screen yeah yeah i can see what's screen. all right uh, so i can call it from here i think this one is would be nice yeah this is this is good uh okay um so what i did here is like i just follow the formula this formula, this is the formula to get a phase distribution. Um, the Can you problem zoom is... a bit because you know, I'm not getting, I'm not able to see this. Okay, that's a parabolic equation, right? Correct? Yes, yes, okay. parameter equation. Uh, I don't know MATLAB how it's, how to zoom. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay, no problem. I can recognize that. Okay, so the problem is that, you know, this phase distribution, I'm not really, Sure, as you, you so told me yesterday, it's like uh, wrapped, you know, it's like uh, it's like a rapid phase, but I don't know how to change it because actually, when I'm getting the phase distribution, it shows like this. See, this is the phase distribution. Do you see it? Yeah, 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 yeah. Now okay, what is the value I'm getting? This is the this is the highest value. Okay, okay. No, 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 no. This is the, I think you know it's wrapping with the plus one eighty to minus one eighty. Okay. What is the feed location you are giving? Uh the feed location is like uh uh it's like one land, I think so. I mean um the direction is like i don't know I, this i have two problem here i'm just asking I, myself is like okay uh the first problem is like the direction of the direction like the feed location of the of the the formula is like sin theta multiplied by cosinus theta phi, right? Yeah, no, no, no. This one is, you know, basically uh, just to convert the uh, rectangular to spherical coordinate system, basically. Okay. Okay. Yeah, this is. So, so but why, why the phase is unwrapped? Sorry? Why the phase is unwrapped? Well, I'm getting unwrapped phase like minus 80 to minus 8. Minus eight, one hundred eighty. I'm getting this. 
because actually even even when i when i'm changing when i'm changing from here when i'm changing this one to no no uh, the first question is like you know uh, what i'm missing is the first question is um, Just a moment, please. OK. Yeah, so if you see the thing is, you know, um, can you go to the code first? The beginning of the code? Yes. Frequency lambda, where is the focal distance? The distance, um, sorry, let me, maybe, yeah, you cannot show, I can show you. This, um, yeah, it's the same code. Here I try to introduce the distance here. Like the distance equals to square root. This one. Okay. Yeah, please what? Which one? Okay, you have face focal distance, right? Yes. One minute, actually. I don't know, is that? Because I tried also to fix it manually, but it's giving me some error. No, 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 that's why, no, it is somewhere, it is getting, you know, wrapped. That's what I could not, can you go back to that is code? It, is it this one? Actually, it's the same code. It's just the same code, but I was just trying to play with. No, no, no. 180 by pi is the one. Uh, it's for the convert that into degree, right? Pi to yes. uh, degree. And you go, can you go a little bit down? I think it's there. And it's in your called... code, can you show me that? Which one? The face? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your code, your code, yeah. Best distribution code. This one? No, no, no. I'm asking about your code. The code? Is this is this your code? Yes. The lambda is 300 by 28. This is uh, um, you are uh, reading it in centimeter, right? Yes. Centimeter. No, 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 no. I think you know you ought to put it in. You have to follow the same thing, same kind of, uh, all the things are in 10, 10 centimeter. Mm, no, this is, this one is millimeters. Millimeter, but that one is? This one is centimeter. Centimeter or millimeter? That one? Point. This one, yeah, I think this one is a millimeter only. I think that yeah. one is also millimeter only, right? 28 yes. gigahertz, so 3 into 10 power 8, um, then by 10 power 9, so okay, yes. with millimeter. So I think better to have me meter that's showing. Okay, that's good actually. So uh, okay. n unit is what? Are a unit cell cell size dimensions? Okay. So where is the f? Which one? Where is the f? F is ten point five frequency. Okay. Oh yes. Frequency. No 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 no. I think you are doing mistake here. No, your F is equal to ten point two. You are giving ten point five. You are giving, but uh, ten point five is not a frequency, right? That's why I'm saying you see, you have to convert all the unit to meter and hertz. Okay, F is equal to hertz, right? Okay. 
and uh, here right square root of f square you are putting right f square it should be this focal one. distance yeah it should be focal distance not the frequency okay okay distance equation right so how they are calculating uh, uh Actually, uh, yeah. actually, I did this one like this. Uh, I also wrote another code line like this, and I give focal distance like manually like this. No, no, no. You see, better to have you know. You please make it as a meter, okay? Everything in okay. meter and also in hertz, okay? And also uh, see the focal distance. It should be. Can you open faint for me and then give control to me? Okay. So it is like this. See, uh, it, this is the reflector, right? Reflector. Yes. This is the focal distance, right? Yes. If I want to calculate the distance between this particular element, there is and there are number of elements are there. Yes. This is the center, right? This is the center yes. line, right? This is the f. If if you are seeing, yeah, focal distance. Okay. Yes. So for example, this one, uh, you know, maybe in the x one location or x two location, right? So yes. This will. How do I find out this location first? How do I find that? Because you know, uh, so so you, so for example, let's say I know this distance, right? For example, let's say D. Okay. Yes. This yes. distance is, for example, D capital D. Okay. Yes. How do I find this? D is equal to square root of mm -hmm. f square plus d square, right? Yes. Okay. Similarly, yes. how can I find out D? How can I find out D? Let me tell you. So this is the array, right? Oh. Correct? Yes. Let's say, uh, oh my God. Let's say this is the origin. Mm -hmm. Okay, I am going to take a distance from the calculated distance for the first element, right? Yes. So first element at angle, this is the x-axis, right? Let's yes. say this is x1 distance. Along y, it is y1, y1 distance, right? Yes. So how can I calculate this? Square root of x1 square plus y1 square, right? Yes. That's what you are given in the equation, right? MATLAB equation yes. also, you are given this. So if you correct that now, you will get exactly the value, values, okay? Can you see here? Okay. You have given this one, what, f square, x1 square plus y1 square, but you have to correct this one, okay? Then only okay. you will get this, okay? You will get it. All right. So I should, uh, I suppose to remove the frequency, right? Correct, correct. So frequency, okay. Okay. I got correct. it. If you yes. sort out these issues, uh, so two action items. One is uh, this one. The other one is um, the that I know uh, reflector. You can try. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yeah. So thank you. So have Thank a great you so day much. now. <laughs> yeah. Thank yeah. you. Uh, have a good have a good night. Yeah, yeah. Good night, please. Yeah, sorry. Thank yeah, you. yeah. Sorry. Uh, right. Have a great day, please. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Have a good night. Oh, Bye. it's too late. Bye. It's too late there. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. Yeah.